Practice Test 3. Use a hacksaw to cut off 6 inches of the armor for making up a junction box when using BX cable. Use a hacksaw to cut off 6 inches of the armor for making up a junction box when using BX cable. Which of the following is not required for a 480Y, 277 volt feeder circuit and panel board? Grounding electrode conductor. Which of the following is not required for a 480Y, 277 volt feeder circuit and panel board? Grounding electrode conductor. Which of the following is not always required in a typical electrical installation? Feeders. Which of the following is not always required in a typical electrical installation? Feeders. Which of the following is not a standard classification for a branch circuit supplying several loads? 25 amperes. Which of the following is not a standard classification for a branch circuit supplying several loads? 25 amperes. The power used by a load supply 20 ampere. 115 volt branch circuit cannot exceed 2300 watts. The power used by a load supply 20 ampere. 115 volt branch circuit cannot exceed 2300 watts. Bonding jumpers shall not be used to connect the equipment grounding conductors of the derived system to the grounded conductor. Bonding jumpers shall not be used to connect the equipment grounding conductors of the derived system to the grounded conductor. Fire alarms are electronically monitored. Fire alarms are electronically monitored. How deep must a trench be on a residential house to bury rigid conduit 120 volts for GFCI protected? 12 inches. How deep must a trench be on a residential house to bury rigid conduit 120 volts? For GFCI protected 12 inches if burying rigid conduit underground in the path of heavy traffic how deep must conduit be 24 inches if burying rigid conduit underground in the path of heavy traffic how deep must conduit be 24 inches when an electrician with minimum experience is about to start an industrial job where are they most likely to need training assistance Installing a switch gear when an electrician with minimum experience is about to start an industrial job, where are they most likely to need training assistance? Installing a switch gear. Rigid metal conduit must be buried at least 6 inches. Rigid metal conduit must be buried at least 6 inches. A 120 volt 20 ampere residential branch circuit may be buried. 12 inches a 120 volt 20 ampere residential branch circuit may be buried 12 inches if a person was hurt on the job and was bleeding from the head how would you stop the bleeding pressure points if a person was hurt on the job and was bleeding from the head how would you stop the bleeding pressure points what is the reason for new fixtures becoming very bright after installing a sub panel in a large garage and tapping power from new panels to feed new garage fixtures wrong leg hookup what is the reason for new fixtures becoming very bright after installing a sub panel in a large garage and tapping power from new panels to feed new garage fixtures wrong leg hookup the best of the following tools to use for cutting off a piece of single conductor number six rubber insulated lead covered cable is hacksaw the best of the following tools to use for cutting off a piece of single conductor number six rubber insulated lead covered cable is hacksaw when working around an obstacle which of the following trades would be most flexible when constructing a house electrician when working around an obstacle which of the following trades would be most flexible when constructing a house? Electrician. The best of the following conductors of electricity is gold. The next best conductor of electricity silver wire. The best of the following conductors of electricity is gold. The next best conductor of electricity silver wire. Which meter has its own source of power? Ohm meter. Which meter has its own source of power? Ohm meter. Which meter is especially useful in testing fuses? Ohm meter. Which meter is especially useful in testing fuses? Ohm meter. Which meter requires calibration each time it is used? Ohm meter. Which meter requires calibration each time it is used? Ohm meter. Unless a multiplier coil is used, how many wires should be surrounded by the ammeter in measuring current in a circuit? 1. 
unless a multiplier coil is used, how many wires should be surrounded by the ammeter in measuring current in a circuit. 1. In measuring millivolts in a thermocouple circuit, what special device is required? Adapter. In measuring millivolts in a thermocouple circuit, what special device is required? Adapter. A. No resistance. Reading on an ohmmeter means there is a short circuit. A. No resistance. Reading on an ohmmeter means there is a short circuit. How would you ground a transformer in a wooden structure? Both A and B, attached to a metallic water pipe, and attached to ground rod. How would you ground a transformer in a wooden structure? Both A and B, attached to a metallic water pipe, and attached to ground rod. What does labeled mean? A tag or other identifying mark that denotes inspection by an approved agency having jurisdiction. What does labeled mean? A tag or other identifying mark that denotes inspection by an approved agency having jurisdiction. Which of the following could be a costly mistake, if not known before making a bid? That there are large buried rocks. Which of the following could be a costly mistake, if not known before making a bid? That there are large buried rocks. If a lawyer's office requires brass cover plates, what must be considered? Price and grounding. If a lawyer's office requires brass cover plates, what must be considered? Price and grounding. On a 30 kVA 480, 208, 120 transformer, where should you ground it? To the neutral. On a 30 kVA 480, 208, 120 transformer, where should you ground it? To the neutral. What is an Edison used for? Fuse base. What is an Edison used for? Fuse base. Why does a motor with an overcurrent protector and a thermal protector trip off? Not enough load. Why does a motor with an overcurrent protector and a thermal protector trip off? Not enough load. Who do you contact when you need to locate where the electric meter will be located for a new home? The electrical supplier. Who do you contact when you need to locate where the electric meter will be located for a new home? The electrical supplier. You, as an electrical contractor, have finished the rough wiring on a new structure. What do you do next? Contact the inspector. You, as an electrical contractor, have finished the rough wiring on a new structure. What do you do next? Contact the inspector. Which of the following would you use to check the power of a circuit? Both, ammeter and voltmeter. Which of the following would you use to check the power of a circuit? Both ammeter and voltmeter. What is the problem with aluminum wiring? All the above conductivity is not as great as copper, the resistance in aluminum wire is greater therefore causing a greater voltage drop. Aluminum wire expands and contracts to greater degree than copper does which causes a poor connection. What is the problem with aluminum wiring? All the above conductivity is not as great as copper, the resistance in aluminum wire is greater therefore causing a greater voltage drop. Aluminum wire expands and contracts to greater degree than copper does which causes a poor connection. To eliminate the possibility of an incorrect reading of the resistance in a parallel circuit. Disconnect one side of the component tested. To eliminate the possibility of an incorrect reading of the resistance in a parallel circuit. Disconnect one side of the component tested. What's in an AC circuit equal? Volts multiplied by amperes multiplied by power factor. What's in an AC circuit equal? Volts multiplied by amperes multiplied by power factor. If the voltmeter reads voltage when placed across the terminals of a switch, then the switch position is open. If the voltmeter reads voltage when placed across the terminals of a switch, then the switch position is open. In troubleshooting a defective unit, what circuits can be eliminated from the testing procedure? Circuits not causing any trouble. In troubleshooting a defective unit, what circuits can be eliminated from the testing procedure? Circuits not causing any trouble. With respect to pulling wires into a conduit, it is usually specified that a certain percentage of the conduit area must be left unoccupied. The purpose of this requirement is to permit pulling the wires in without undue strain or abrasion. With respect to pulling wires into a conduit, it is usually specified that a certain percentage of the conduit area must be left unoccupied. 
The purpose of this requirement is to permit pulling the wires in without undue strain or abrasion. When installing electric wiring it is essential that all conduits be rigidly supported. When installing electric wiring it is essential that all conduits be rigidly supported. What meter is used to measure the resistance of the wire covering, insulations? Mega meter. What meter is used to measure the resistance of the wire covering, insulations? Mega meter. High voltage switches in power plants are commonly so constructed that their contacts are submerged in oil. The purpose of the ill is to help quench arcing. High voltage switches in power plants are commonly so constructed that their contacts are submerged in oil. The purpose of the ill is to help quench arcing. Ohm's law. Given 8 amps and 120 volts, what is the resistance in ohms? 15 ohms. Ohm's law. Given 8 amps and 120 volts, what is the resistance in ohms? 15 ohms. How many wires are used for the main power supplying to a building? 3. How many wires are used for the main power supplying to a building? 3. If a residence has electric heating, what amperage service to the building is required? 200 amp minimum. If a residence has electric heating, what amperage service to the building is required? 200 amp minimum. A 20 hours P induction motor has a full load current of 54 amps on a 240 volt circuit with a phase angle of 30 degrees. What is the true power used by the circuit? 19,440. Formula. Amps times volts times COS of angle times 1.732 which equals true power used by the circuit, VA. A 20 hours P induction motor has a full load current of 54 amps on a 240 volt circuit with a phase angle of 30 degrees. What is the true power used by the circuit? 19,440. Formula. Amps times volts times COS of angle times 1.732 which equals true power used by the circuit, VA. What is the minimum voltages that should be used for a motor rated at 120 VAC? 108. What is the minimum voltages that should be used for a motor rated at 120 VAC? 108. What is the normal voltage drop using a 50 foot of number 14 wire carrying 15 amps? 2.50. What is the normal voltage drop using a 50 foot of number 14 wire carrying 15 amps? 2.50 Which of the following is the ground wire color on a branch circuit? Green Which of the following is the ground wire color on a branch circuit? Green What is the connection to the main panel called when an additional fuse panel is added? Power take off What is the connection to the main panel called when an additional fuse panel is added? Power take off. Who should be contacted if the voltage is too low coming into the main service panel? The power company. Who should be contacted if the voltage is too low coming into the main service panel? The power company. An approved metallic shielding for electrical wire is called this wall conduit. An approved metallic shielding for electrical wire is called this wall conduit. What size branch circuit can usually be recommended by code for heating a furnace? 15 amp. What size branch circuit can usually be recommended by code for heating a furnace? 15 amp. How many circuits are required to operate a two-speed fan? Just one circuit. How many circuits are required to operate a two-speed fan? Just one circuit. On a call for heating, what two terminals on the thermostat close make? R and W. On a call for heating, what two terminals on the thermostat close make? R and W. An electrician is running conduit at a gas station hazardous location. The conduit must be sealed off at 18 inches. An electrician is running conduit at a gas station hazardous location. The conduit must be sealed off at 18 inches with a cutout temperature of 200 degrees Fahrenheit for the limit control. What would the normal cut-in be? 175 degrees Fahrenheit. What is the usual cutout temperature for the secondary control unit? 145 degrees Fahrenheit. With a cutout temperature of 200 degrees Fahrenheit for the limit control, what would the normal cut-in be? 175 degrees Fahrenheit. What is the usual cutout temperature for the secondary control unit? 
145 degrees Fahrenheit when the thermostat calls for cooling. What two terminals on the thermostat close, make? R and Y. When the thermostat calls for cooling, what two terminals on the thermostat close, make? R and Y. What control device activates a timed fan start? Thermostat. What control device activates a timed fan start? Thermostat. What accessory can be added that requires a secondary power supply? Cooling. What accessory can be added that requires a secondary power supply? Cooling. What are the new thermostat terminals required when a two-stage gas valve arrangement is used? W1 and W2. What are the new thermostat terminals required when a two-stage gas valve arrangement is used? W1 and W2. In testing a fan relay, what voltage is usually applied to the relay coil? 24V. In testing a fan relay, what voltage is usually applied to the relay coil? 24V. Which of the following is most accurate? For electrical installations of over 600 volts, electrical equipment can be guarded by location in the vault, room, closet or by being in an area enclosed by a wall, screen or fence that is at least 7 feet high. Electrical code 110. Which of the following is most accurate? For electrical installations of over 600 volts, electrical equipment can be guarded by location in the vault, room, closet or by being in an area enclosed by a wall, screen or fence that is at least 7 feet high. Electrical code 110. Which of the following is most accurate? In indoor installation where electrical equipment is operating at over 600 volts is accessible to unqualified persons, the equipment must be, all of the above of metal clad construction, enclosed in a vault and in a locked area. Which of the following is most accurate? In indoor installation where electrical equipment is operating at over 600 volts is accessible to unqualified persons, the equipment must be, all of the above. Of metal clad construction, enclosed in a vault and in a locked area, which is most accurate entrances to rooms and other guarded locations containing live parts must be marked with conspicuous warning signs, stating, danger, high voltage. Which is most accurate entrances to rooms and other guarded locations containing live parts must be marked with conspicuous warning signs, stating, danger, high voltage, in a series motor, if there was no load on the motor, the armature would speed up considerably. In a series motor, if there was no load on the motor, the armature would speed up considerably. True or false? It is best to use a series motor with a belt connected load rather than direct drive. False. Direct drive better than belt connection. It is best to use a series motor with a belt connected load rather than direct drive. False. Direct drive better than belt connection. True or false? Series motor is more susceptible to overload than shunt motors? False. Series motor is more susceptible to overload than shunt motors? False. True or false? Compound motors have both a shunt and a series field. True. Compound motors have both a shunt and a series field. True. True or false? More armature is required of the differential compound motor than of the shunt motor for the same torque. True. More armature is required of the differential compound motor than of the shunt motor for the same torque. True. True or false? Of the various motor types, the differential compound is used more widely than other motors. False. Of the various motor types, the differential compound is used more widely than other motors. False. If the load is removed from a compound motor it will speed up slightly. If the load is removed from a compound motor it will speed up slightly. The speed of a DC motor can be controlled by either varying the voltage to the armature or by varying voltage going to the field. The speed of a DC motor can be controlled by either varying the voltage to the armature or by varying voltage going to the field. In 1978 the electrical code changed on repairing plaster or drywall surfaces at the edge of the box or fitting. The code now requires that the surfaces that are broken or incomplete shall, 
have gaps no larger than eighth of an inch, at the edge of the fitting. In 1978 the electrical code changed on repairing plaster or drywall surfaces at the edge of the box or fitting. The code now requires that the surfaces that are broken or incomplete shall, have gaps no larger than eighth of an inch, at the edge of the fitting. What is the lighting load calculation used to determine the VA per square foot rating of a hospital? 2. What is the lighting load calculation used to determine the VA per square foot rating of a hospital? 2. Pools that qualify as a storable pool, assuming the skimmer intake is less than 6 inches below the top and less than 20 feet wide. Pools that qualify as a storable pool, assuming the skimmer intake is less than 6 inches below the top and less than 20 feet wide. When you must locate a disconnecting means for the motor, if an indoor spa has a 3 quarter HP circulating motor with a controller located in the basement of the house next door and the control buttons, in a class 2 control circuit, are on the spa? Both locations. The basement within sight and within sight of the spa. When you must locate a disconnecting means for the motor, if an indoor spa has a 3 quarter HP circulating motor with a controller located in the basement of the house next door and the control buttons, in a class 2 control circuit, are on the spa? Both locations. The basement within sight and within sight of the spa. You purchased a swimming pool pump motor for an above ground pool, a 6 foot length of 16. 3 SJT cord with molded straight blade cord cap and a Type NM cable connector, also rated for that size, the pool is above the ground, therefore the owner wants to put the filter as close to the pool as possible. What is wrong with the cord and connector? All the above, too small, the configuration and they are not the right location. You purchased a swimming pool pump motor for an above ground pool, a 6 foot length of 16. 3 SJT cord with molded straight blade cord cap and a Type NM cable connector, also rated for that size, the pool is above the ground, therefore the owner wants to put the filter as close to the pool as possible. What is wrong with the cord and connector? All the above, too small, the configuration and they are not the right location. Which of the following? if located within 5 feet of a pool or part of its recirculation system, needs to be grounded. All the above. Double insulated motor, metal fence and a metal forming shell. Which of the following, if located within 5 feet of a pool or part of its recirculation system, needs to be grounded. All the above. Double insulated motor, metal fence and a metal forming shell. Which of the following arrangements must be used for an underwater junction box in a fountain, if the box's threaded hubs have no mounting lugs or feet? Both the above. Two or more brass or stainless conduit supports and potted. Which of the following arrangements must be used for an underwater junction box in a fountain, if the box's threaded hubs have no mounting lugs or feet? Both the above. Two or more brass or stainless conduit supports and potted. How far away from a spa must the light switch be for the pool lighting if the switch is a standard snap switch in a flush non-metallic box? 5 feet. How far away from a spa must the light switch be for the pool lighting if the switch is a standard snap switch in a flush non-metallic box? 5 feet. Which of the following is required by CA OSHA orders? Rubber leather gloves shall be worn at the time when working on high voltage currents. Which of the following is required by CA OSHA orders? Rubber leather gloves shall be worn at the time when working on high voltage currents. In an engineered building you need to drill a hole through a steel beam. You would you consult with before drilling? The engineer. In an engineered building you need to drill a hole through a steel beam. You would you consult with before drilling? The engineer. What is the current resistance formula when using Ohm's law? R equals E over I. What is the current resistance formula when using Ohm's law? R equals E over I. In a commercial building with 25-foot ceilings, what type of lighting would be best to install? High pressure sodium. In a commercial building with 25-foot ceilings, what type of lighting would be best to install? High pressure sodium. What would you use to test jacket insulation? Megometer. What would you use to test jacket insulation? Megometer. You have a 480V motor with 9 leads. How would you wire it? Feeder lines to 1, 2 and 3, connect 6 and 9, nice, 4 and 8, 5 and 7. You have a 480V motor with 9 leads, how would you wire it? 
feeder lines to 1, 2 and 3, connect 6 and 9, nice, 4 and 8, 5 and 7. EMT must be supported a minimum from box. 36 inches. EMT must be supported a minimum from box. 36 inches. What is the maximum conduit for class 1 division 2 toxic area? Liquid tight flexible metal conduit. What is the maximum conduit for class 1 division 2 toxic area? Liquid tight flexible metal conduit. What should you use to stop toxic fumes in conduit? Sealing compound. What should you use to stop toxic fumes in conduit? Sealing compound. How any conductors are allowed in a sheet of metal auxiliary gutter before you calculate from heat reduction? 30 conductors. How any conductors are allowed in a sheet of metal auxiliary gutter before you calculate from heat reduction? 30 conductors. The sum of the cross-sectional areas of all contained conductors at any cross-section of a sheet metal auxiliary gutter shall not exceed 20% of the interior cross-sectional area of the gutter. The sum of the cross-sectional areas of all contained conductors at any cross-section of a sheet metal auxiliary gutter shall not exceed 20% of the interior cross-sectional area of the gutter. Which of the three elements from last question, does the electrical code attempt to eliminate in a hazardous area? Source of ignition. Which of the three elements from last question, does the electrical code attempt to eliminate in a hazardous area? Source of ignition. Which of the following is the proper procedure to use when disposing of a fluorescent light? Place in recycle bin. Which of the following is the proper procedure to use when disposing of a fluorescent light? Place in recycle bin. If the load of the motor is reduced, then the motor tends to maintain the same speed. If the load of the motor is reduced, then the motor tends to maintain the same speed. True or false? The shunt motor is essentially a constant speed machine. True. The shunt motor is essentially a constant speed machine. True. True or false, where there is variation in load, compound motors have the most desirable feature not found in stunt motors. False. Where there is variation in load, compound motors have the most desirable feature not found in stunt motors. False. When an electrical contractor saves a building owner money by changes in the specifications of plans of a job this is called change order. When an electrical contractor saves a building owner money by changes in the specifications of plans of a job this is called change order. How do you identify the terminal of A on a three-way switch, when two control locations are required? Traveler. How do you identify the terminal of A on a three-way switch, when two control locations are required? Traveler. What is the minimum rebar for grounding? Number 4. What is the minimum rebar for grounding? Number 4. 